Hey, what's going on guys? Thanks for checking out this video of my sports, Gametria. In this video, I'm going to go over an NBA game for Wednesday, February 23rd, 2021. I'm going to show you both sides of, of the game, and it's going to be up to you to determine who you think is going to win based on the numbers. I encourage you to add additional information on top of this if needed for you to feel confident in your own pick. And if for some reason you're curious to know who I am picking in these games, you're going to have to join my Patreon where my picks are always in writing, underlined, and italicized. For more information on that, please read the description of this video. I wish, I wish you guys the best of luck in your pick today. Let's go ahead and get into the game. We are going to be looking at the Warriors versus the Pacers. Alright, so date, date numerology, daily numbers, Gregorian Hebrew, game numbers, away team on top, head-to-head -head record, home team at the bottom. So if the Pacers were going to win this game, and you want the Pacers to win this game, the numbers that you're probably going to be looking for will be that it's the Warriors, 33rd game for the season. It's their 16th away game for the season. That's the Pacers' 17th home game for the season. The Warriors can become 17 and 16 for a season record with the loss as the Pacers get their 16th win for the season. The number 16 sums to 33. Today has a 47 date numerology on the Gregorian, 47 sums to 50, and 49. And the Pacers can go from 49 to 50 all-time head-to-head wins against the Warriors. Today is the 55th day on the Gregorian, and Pacers can go ahead and sweep the Warriors 2-0 head-to-head against for the season like 20. The number 20 sums to 55. In regards to it being the 47 date numerology with the 50 and 49, 47 is the 15th prime number, and the number 610 is the 15th Fibonacci number. And the Warriors with the loss would become 610 at home, or excuse me, on the road for a season record with the loss as they do that 17-16 connection. Pacers would become 2-0. Pacers can become 8-9 at home for a season record with the win, like 89. Today is the 24th of February, and the number 89 sums to 24. So that's what it would look like for the Pacers to win. Now, if you're looking for the Warriors to win this game, you know, Warriors coach can sit on that 153rd regular season loss with the win, the 17th triangular number. And even though Warriors come in with 17 wins, it is Pacers' 17th home game. So that could maybe play in favor of Warriors. Warriors would sit on 15 losses, for the season with a win. Today does have 47 date numerology on the Gregorian. 47 is the 15th prime number. The Pacers would become 15 and 15 for a season record with a loss. Today is the 55th day of the Gregorian. 55 is the 10th triangular number. And I know one of these two teams is going to get their 10th loss, either Warriors away or Pacers 10th home loss. Today has 31 date numerology on the Gregorian, 31 the 11th prime. Warriors can even the score 1-1 one one head to head against the Pacers with the win. Warriors would also get their 45th all time head to head win against the Pacers. Today does have 67 date numerology on the Gregorian, 67 does sum to 45. Also 13 date numerology on the Gregorian, and I don't have it written up here, but 13 also sums to, to 45. And it is the 94th all-time head-to-head matchup between these two teams. 
and it could be just as simple as Pacers sitting on 49 all-time head-to-head wins against Warriors with the loss. 94, 49, reflections of each other. So those are the two numbers, two sides for this game. Hopefully this is enough information for you to make a pick. If not, hopefully this is enough information for you to build upon and add more to. Other stuff you can add is name gamatria for the teams, coach name gamatria, distance to and from birthdays, location. I wish you guys the best of luck. Hopefully this helps, and thank you for watching.